Hello YouTube, this is Killer Frog, and welcome to another campaign. Today we will play as Pontus. Pontus is an Eastern Empire's faction. They have the, they have some nice traits like the Great Merksman, which give us a bonus 25% uh, on ammunition for all units. They also have the Secret Police, which increase um, our defense against all agents in all pro of our provinces. Also. As the faction, we have a moderate diplomatic bonus with uh, with all Hellenic factions, and we also have the shrewd operators, which cut in half all our agent action costs. So, if you want to read the text, feel free to do so. And also, we will play as the legendary difficulty. Yeah. So, without any ado, let's start this. Fortunate in your ties to both Hellenic and Eastern cultures, you nonetheless face adversity. Cappadocia, now independent from Seleucid rule, is eager to establish itself in Asia. Cultural differences with the Galatians may lead to hostility, but they are fearsome warriors and might prove valuable if unconventional allies. Maintain close relations with Bithynia and Trapezos and establish ties with the venerable Greek states. This way, you will be better protected against the machinations of the Seleucids and can focus on seizing control of the Pontic Sea from barbarian hands. Power and riches will be yours. Pontus will reign supreme. All right, so let's go. Thank you, advisor. Let's start by moving our spy to Mazaka. And we will start them really quickly. Let's merge our armies together, like so. The plan will be to um, go to uh, Samosata as soon as possible. And by merging our armies, we will cut, uh, we will save some money by disbanding the general. And also we will disband the, the fleet, like so. For the development, we will go Let's go to Sinope, and we will build two monster fields. One will be for the melee units, the other for the range one. And also, uh, this will give us a nice garrison in Sinope, or Sinope, I don't, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. So, we'll have like a, a safe settlement from the possible naval invasion and possible enemies too. So, yes, and let's recruit some units like the Eastern Spearmen and the Slingers. For the technology, we will go for... Uh, around there, for the O-Plate Barracks to have some decent units as quickly as possible. And we'll see in the diplomacy if we can have some trade partners like the Trapezos. Greetings, honored guest! Are they willing to pay us? Maybe. Nope. That's okay. I had hoped you thought better of us. A bribe. I'm a Do we have any other trade partners? Maybe the Athenians? I am honored to greet such an ambassador of such worthy people. What if we I'm give sorry. them some money? I gain only the scorn of the Just gods a tiny bit. people if I agree to your proposal. Like so. Yes, that's perfect. With these words, you bring. And sorry, this I don't think so. We'll wait to see uh, if the Seleucid empires feel to uh, feels to trade with us or not. We'll see. Excellent. We are ready to end our first turn. Wise enough not to sit idly upon the back. This is some money, so let's take it. I'm always willing for some money. All right. So yes, they are they are starving as planned. 
Let's move over our troop just a bit. A tiny bit. Around here. And let's recruit one more turn. Alright. Still stealing food. Perfect. And next turn we will be ready to take our first settlement. My lord. Is winning yeah, no, I'm not feeling for peace. Of course not. They leave, which is a uh, good news for us. And our spy took a level, so let's give him a skill to steal more food. Like that one, the menace. And now let's go to. Samosata. This is an easy win, so we won't fight that one. A oh, nice stabby stab in the neck. Always nice to see. And yeah, that's a goodbye. Alright, we have our first settlement. Let's convert uh, the, the, the village. We have the nice one that. Uh, is from our culture and now let's recruit some more units maybe a little bit more spearmen all right and we also have uh, a new skill point for our general so let's go for a strategist and we can see how the Zulu kid feel about us maybe they are feeling Greetings. great we are civilized folk so you may speak yeah not yet I think maybe when we uh, will have some iron to trade maybe they'll be willing to trade to and they'll be a big uh, trade partner all right it's going good Between so far friends. The gift of gold is often taken to be a sign of deep. We are not willing to pay. We want money, not to give it. Come on. You are wise enough not to sit idly upon the bank. Maybe for money, but I don't think that they will be willing to. Indeed. I respectfully ask for No, thank you. And it's time to start moving forward. Alright. Let's have some more timber. And build... Um, oh boy. Olosideros Barracks. I have no idea how to pronounce that. And the Periocos uh, camp. So now we'll add some archers and kinda decent melee units. So next turn we'll be able to have some iron. Take this no, we don't want peace. Peace was never an option. Ha. And there we go. Let's go, let's go. We have finished that technology. That's good. And we have another easy fight. That looks artful. I'd say. And as a Kapayan. So now we have half of that province. And we have a new Empire round. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. Now, now I guess it's a good time to starve the Galatian, I guess. Sardes is having a good start. 
swift and silent. Is there nothing else? And we'll build a farm just to be sure to have enough food for later with all the upgrades that are coming uh, soon. And we'll trade more wine. Where will they go? They'll come back. That's perfect. We'll upgrade our general. And I think we'll stay like this for now. And yep, yeah, we also have a new tradition. Let's go for our formidable spiders. And also we'll go for the technician the tactician to have some more uh, campaign map move movement range. Like so. And next turn we'll see uh, with the solo kids. Maybe they'll be ready, willing we to trade. Oh well, they're going back for uh, double setup. We'll see how it goes. Uh, inspired endeavors. Oh, that's nice. Some public order. If we defeat that army, so we should be good. Yeah, we can go back. That's good. Let's see if we can trade. Greetings. Yeah, they're not so happy since we Stand trespassed. There, mute as though with the tongue cut from your head. Speak. And also because they are at war with uh, our neighbors, which we have good relation, I guess. Uh, yeah. Yeah, pretty much. So maybe we'll go at war soon. We'll see. The Cappadocians have some units. Yes. I guess we'll go back to defend. Then after that turn, we'll go up and then we'll be ready to recruit uh, better units. So let's have some more money, I guess. We'll start with some growth, I think. Then we'll go for the money. Alright, alright. Return to your people and oh well. prepare them for death. That is now your only duty. We won't call the allies to help. I don't want them to come by and take some settlement. We want Armenia for ourselves. Oh, really? Okay. Well, we'll do our best. Let's do that little skirmish. Let's pull the unit back. Nice. They took the bait. Let's try to stop the general, but... Oh yeah, that's working. The men are wavering. The generals should be dead pretty soon. Come on. Let's pull the senior back. Our men flee the field of battle. This is 
shameful display. Another time! Whatever, lawyer! Let's try to reinforce our pikemen. A tiny bit with some crappy units. Those that are horrible, but hey. Our general is under attack. Slingers! Our orders! It's all good. So good so far. So far, so good. I'm not sure. Anyway, everything is fine. So we have some nice shots. Maybe that unit can... Maybe they can target uh, the seniors. It would be great. Mm, no, they can't, apparently. No, they can't. Let's reform. By holding out we can move the unit like so. So we'll try. We'll try to move a little bit the pikemen, and by pressing control, they will walk, so they'll keep the the pikes down. So we'll try to push them a bit. Okay, we had the one unit. Time to push with the pikemen now. We are playing a bit more aggressive. Oh no. That was bad. I just tried to reform them. And <laughs> they just leave. Uh, oh yeah, they break. Of course. Let's push uh, the Hillman again. Nice, nice. Let's try to hit the seniors. No, 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 no. Not with the pikemen. Uh, what happened? Okay, we're good. Push, push, push. Alright, so nice victory there. The mob was quite effective to install the, the cap units. So yeah, that went pretty well. And let's release them for more, more money. And, oh, I'm pretty sure we destroyed them now. We'll see at the end, but I'm pretty sure. Yep, the Cappadocians are out. Officially. Uh, mission successful, excellent. Alright. Now it's time to hit the uh, Armenians. Let's try to surprise them. A nice easy battle. I don't think we will fight that. A little stab again. Not really a stab, but more like a slash, I guess. Uh, anyway, let's occupy it. So now we have another settlement. Of course, we will start comfort building. And let's uh, have a muster field. So, yeah, in two turns, we'll be able to, have to upgrade a bit our armies. Army, I mean. And 
with that money, I think we will start to raise another army to go after the Galatians. Oh, they pushed back. Oh well. How may I serve you? How's the food? Almost starving. I am a Let's sabotage the settlement. Oh, or not. 40% is bad. Can we do something to them? Still bad. So we'll try, I guess, to sabotage the settlement. And we'll see. Maybe we'll have enough uh, experience. I have completed my mission. This way is getting information. I am shadows and dust. All right. So now you ranked up, and we'll be able to starve them the next turn. So we'll try to starve them, and with the new armies, uh, the new army will be able to take their settlements. That's the plan. We'll see. And let's build some earning grounds, earn a little bit more money. And we'll have also our rebellion soon, so let's hurry up. We need some nice traits. That could be nice. The the minus 20% on public order penalties due to presence of foreign cultures. With the Armenians and all, that could be nice. 5% tariff incomes uh, from trade agreements. I like that. Let's do that. And let's reinstate the our first army that uh, we disband. Let's recruit some cav, and there we go. We need to recruit some nice troops. Let's start with some eastern archers, like so. And let's see if we can trade with more people. Maybe Cyprus. Greetings, friend. Greetings. Will you have Are they willing to pay? Fine olives or agreeable talk? Not that much. Maybe a bit. They are willing. Nice. We Greeks. How about Rhodos? I am honored to greet such an ambassador yes. of such worthy people. Are they rich? My ears. Maybe enough. Ah, that was close. I feel. Gold is usually uh, offered payment. In payment of service. We are not your servants. That's why it is. That should be are good. We? All right. I must accept more money, and let's trade with uh, Bergamon. May Hermes bless us both with skillful tongues that are we they willing speak to pay? our parts well. Of course they so are. Reach agreement. Oh. Oh. God. We'll take you it. Wisdom should always. That was a nice trade. I like that. That's good. Let us hope today. Thank you, friend. Who else? Galasha, no. Maybe the Odrician. Greetings to you. I trust you come with honorable work. Yeah, no. Okay, that would be good. Nice. A nice little boost to our income. That's perfect. I misclicked, and we are ready for the next turn. Only one turn is left to our technology. So next turn, maybe we'll be able to build the next barrack. That, that would be nice. Alright, alright. Or not. In five turns. That's okay. Yeah, we won't build the next skirmisher uh, building because these are our skirmishers. They're just, in my opinion, bad. And so it costs more food for basically almost nothing. And the next level, there is also nothing. So we left, uh, we left uh, the construction at level two. So we'll have some nice peltas, which are pretty plenty strong. Uh, also, uh, they have the uh, they have the precision shot ability, which let me show you. 
So yeah, so he, that increased the damage that they deal. And if I remember right, the missile damage is about 39 when they have the precision shot. Like, a volley of these Peltas with a precision shot and Cav is absolutely devastating. So they are good flanking units. So that's why we'll take a few of them. And then we'll go with some uh, Pontic Swordsmen. They are pretty decent for the price too. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And yeah, that should be good. For now. I think next turn we will recruit some cap. Like so. With a little bit of infantry. Just in case we have to rush early, earlier around the, the rebellion. Ready for, for that army, next turn we'll be able to start upgrading it. That's perfect. And let's disband the, the unit that was that was damaged. All right, maybe that faction died. I'm not sure. Yes, indeed. So we have an opportunity, maybe by declaring war soon to the Solar Kid, we'll be able to have uh, the capital. That would be nice. Disease. We don't like that. Oh, no, we don't. Oh, that's bad. That is bad. Um. I feel like we should recruit maybe some mercenaries and attack them immediately since we have our full strength. Yeah. We hunger for battle. To battle! So we should be able to defeat them. So... Yeah. I think we'll be able to outgun the the the, the stern uh, slingers with the the skirmishers. So yeah. Nope. Yep. There we go. It seemed like we were a bit uphill, but very slightly. So let's start the front line with our spearmen, like so. Let's support them with slingers that we will left in the square formation because they can rotate more easier and also uh, by rotating like more easily they will be able to also fire quicker or more quickly. There we go, there we go, there we go. And let's use our general a little bit behind. And we'll use the mercenaries on the flank. On the left flank and the right flank. Alright. So let's go to battle. Understood. We will group them so they'll move uh, at the same time. So I thought so. Apparently not. Let's ungroup them. Uh, I mean, unlock them, and we'll move the senior, the seniors a bit forward. They were a bit too far for my taste, like so. 
And we are about to make contact with the enemy line. That should be good. Oh, come on. Just a tiny bit. Can we fire? No. General! Come on, let's go. Now we are in range. So the Austrian should lose. They are... Yeah. So they will have some good volleys landing on them. I like the screen, the war screaming. Are they doing like the... Do -do 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 -do? I don't know how to say it. <laughs> Everything's good so far. The spearmen are taking the hits. That's perfect. That's what we want. They're starting to rout. And they are starting to march forward. So let's try to refocus our seniors and the horse archers. Let's throw some pilums at them, like so. Excellent. Maybe we'll be able to do the same. We await your order. Ready. And let's try to attack them in the back. They are taking the hits, that's perfect. Nice Pilum Volley in the back. At speed. Engage. Quick march. We await your orders. Hillmen. They are mercenaries, they are meant to die. So that's perfect. Let's use them. Slingers. Let's put some slingers on the flank. At speed. Oh, our slingers, we forgot to. Put them on guard mode. So now they are acting a little bit stupid. But that's all fine. We got this. Oh, that will hurt. Some Kredafrax in the flanks. No, let's put them on, on guard mode. So we won't have to do that again. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shame. Excellent. Let's finish off their uh, seniors and let's go around with the, the general to try to break them. Oh, they passed through. Alright. Let's hit them. Let's punish them a bit for breaking our line. Our general is under attack. Let's move our slingers. Let's pull back our general. Let's 
Let's move the seniors on the flanks. Let's use the Spearman to uh, hold them. And they are about to break, so let's charge with the General to break them once and for all. Let's open the way. Time to focus the General. Let's continue to kill the general, and that should be good. Royal Cavalry. The enemy general Excellent. Is dead. We're good to go. And yeah, I think that this will be a wiped out. So yeah, we have about uh, 1200 loss, and they have about 2000. And now they have disease too, if they survive. Well, that's fine, that's fine. Let's release them, have some more money. And let's finish them off. Now they are sick and dead, that's perfect. That's how I like my enemies. Uh, and let's release them again for the survivors. Spread the word. For the word. I think the word. Yeah. Anyway. Um, they are still sick. Let's merge them. Let's disband them. And yeah. We'll keep the slingers. Since we have no better options anyway. Um yeah, some uplites could be good. Some ailments too. Uh, the ailment and yeah, we'll start with a full ailment recruit grave and then we'll go for the uplites since the the upkeep is like the double. Like so. That way we will have a nice defensive army. And we'll have the offensive army getting ready. Pretty soon. So... Yeah, in two turns we will have a, re a rebellion. So one turn and then... I think we will recruit some... Yeah. Next turn we will recruit two Plitays and two Swordsmen. So we'll have like... Yeah. I think that will be pretty decent. And we'll have the Cav, that's perfect. Maybe more archers, we'll see, we'll see. We still have a bit of time to think, to think about it. Now let's go for Philosopher. We'll have some cultural, cultural conversion and we will have some offensive skill available to us very soon also. So that can't be bad. We for, uh, I forgot to deploy our spy, that's uh, that's my bad. Next turn I'll deploy it and we'll be able to start the starvation. Child is born, rebellion imminent, yes. How can I assist? Observing. Wait, what? Ah. We'll have another turn. As planned. I am yours to command. And now, how's the food? Ah, that's bad. Do they have another settlement? No. Well. Let's start to move a bit. 
Let's recruit for our final turn. We, need good fighters. we will recruit a total of six of six archers and some uh, swordsmen. Like so. Can we have one more? No, we can't. That's okay. Ready for orders. And we are ready to go. As all the gods look down. Nope. Give money if you want something. That's how we roll. I dare not ask much also, for my people. Nope. Only a single Let's go for the experience. I don't think we will recruit any cap soon, but anyway. That could be useful. Who knows? We will be on imminent. That's okay. Let's tax them. And. Let's start to defend Mazaka since uh, the garrison is a bit tinier. And I think we will be in the, our territory, so we'll be able to recruit some crappy unit, like the Spearman, to take some hits for us. And then we have that army. Can we recruit a hero? Yes, we can. And yes, that could be good. I guess we'll go for that one. Save a little bit on the on the upkeep, and also uh, under a better re re replenishment. That's always good. How may I say? All right. Maybe we will merge some uh, of the spearmen, and we'll try to recruit a bit more. What do we want now? Uh, that's that's the question. We'll go for the early days. So we'll have a kind of decent army. Of course. That would be nice uh, if they could spawn here. Mysteries of Elysis, which give us uh, some public order and Hellenic cultural influence in all of our regions. That's good. Now, what do we do? Let's move our spy to see if there's an enemy here. Hopefully not. Oh, the Galatians are growing really quickly. They have an army. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh. And the little kids are pretty close too. Okay, Armenia. Maybe if they are willing to peace, yes. Speak your words. No. And be sure that I Let's find try to have some money, them. and then we can move uh, into a better position for our ourselves. And we'll try to hold that settlement with uh, a small army to defeat any rebellion that could spawn. By the flame, you offer little. Ready for all. Hopefully they will run. Nice. On the move. I want hourly patrol. Ready for battle. And now, if we are wild, maybe 
we can go to Iconia, and then after I will it, we will eat the capital. So that would, I think, be a nice, uh, a nice world for us. Yep, yep. And Sinope is still have a, a great defense. So unless they have like two armies, we should be good around here. So yeah, let's start moving. The garrison is um, pretty bad. Excellent. That's good for us. Maybe we could deploy the agent and win some time. Yeah, I think we will do that. But we will move it in uh, a bit to have uh, a view go out here. Alright. Everything is fine. Let's end our turns. Our turn. And... Uh, sure, let's help. If it can give us a bit of experience and also improve our relationship a bit with uh, the solo kit. Let's release them. Can you not see? I humbly ask that you at least consider a formal treaty. Strong defenses need Let's not. So we have some military traditions. That's good. And what could we do? We don't have archers yet, so I think we will go for the stalwart defenders. Uh, they give that give us like more stuff to defend, and also uh, on the long one, that will give us a nice bonus for our melee defense and also a better armor. So for like an Oplites army, this is I think um, the the best option for them. It's also super good for the Spartan faction since it's all AV and spears. Um, what do we want next? I think we want some growth, so let's go for it. Like so. So after these technologies, we will have. Uh, a bonus for on our growth in all our provinces. What can you do now? Well, now I kind of regret to make peace with the Armenians. But we can move that army up to Mazaka. Maybe just go around here. And they will be ready to support for the capital after that fight. That's good, that's good. Let's move our agent to see if there's an army. Hopefully not, because I don't want to get ambushed. There is. Okay. Let's wait for our turn. Let's build uh, the the fortification. Just pass our yeah, so look it. Okay. Everything's good. So let's end this turn and next turn we'll go to war. Also we are 
pretty close to the end of our first part. Uh, if you like it, feel free to subscribe. Uh, also to comment uh, that you subscribe, let me know. Uh, I'll do my best to answer to the, the most, uh, the most uh, people, as, as many people as possible. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Um, and that should be pretty easy now since uh, one of our subscribers are pretty low, but hey, let's hope to change that. And yeah, if you want more stuff like this, feel free to subscribe. And if you have campaign ideas, you can also let me know. That could be pretty cool. I'd like to play also as a minor faction. I like that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So at the beginning of the next part, we will start with a nice fight. And also a nice war. So thank you everyone for watching and we'll see you in the next part.